Mulishani. Mule Bwanji. Mule Wuti. Muchiwani. Muji Beepi Mwani. Mudinga I Mwani. Greetings and welcome to the EasyGate channel. The Lusaka Securities Exchange is Zambia's primary equities market. This channel's intent is to place a spotlight on the equities traded on the exchange, zoning in on their historical profit trends and shareholder benefits. And now, a look at the stock in view for this episode. In this episode, we will focus on an acquisition announcement that concerns shareholders of Puma Energy Zambia PLC. You may recall that, a couple of weeks ago on episode 7 we discussed Puma Energy Zambia's 2022 stock price growth, current fundamentals, and the positive impact that we believe the monthly pricing cycle for fuel is having on the company's performance. If you have not seen that episode, click on the link to the playlist. Now, last week on the 26th of January, Puma Energy announced that it had entered into a transaction with Ogas Zambia Limited to acquire Ogas's liquefied petroleum gas LPG related assets. The acquisition is priced at 64.6 million kwacha or 3.4 million US dollars. Puma Energy Zambia LTD appear to be looking to strategically position themselves for the long term in the current evolving oil and gas sourcing and distribution market in Zambia. According to the Patents and Companies Registration Agency PACRA Records, Ogas Limited was incorporated in 2012. The company is a 100% Zambian-owned company that supplies a range of industrial gases and related services, primarily LPG. Puma Energy Zambia's rationale to enter the LPG market is to diversify their product offering to retail customers and jump on the opportunities presented by what they say is a conducive environment for clean cooking promotion by various international actors and the local government. We think it is a good move. From the transaction announcement report, the key Ogas assets purchased are 1. The LPG facility consisting of two tanks at a capacity of 50 metric tons each. This sits on 7,082 square meters of commercial real estate. 2. A pool of 37,000 LPG cylinders. 3. The open orders or supply agreements with resellers, and lastly, miscellaneous assets that include trucks. The acquisition value equates to about 8% of the market cap of Puma Energy. Reiterating our position from Episode 7. We believe the Puma stock is still undervalued. And, its move into the LPG space will broaden its product scope significantly as the rate of adoption of LPG use at commercial, retail and residential level is seemingly expanding from community reports and discussions. The EasyGate channel operator does not work in the financial industry and is not qualified to give investment advice. This and other productions must not be considered as issuing such advice, but simply represent the research, observations, and opinions of the operator. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, leave a comment, and be sure to subscribe to be notified of future videos.